Just a, a quick demonstration on a very useful little file that I've come across. Um, the program is called Virtual Magnifying Glass VMG um, and this is the installation of it which I'm about to perform. As you can see we get the warning up. Do you want to allow the following program? Unknown program? Yes we do, we don't mind. We want it in English preferably and here's the installation procedure. Just accept the agreement. Uh, this software is uh, totally freeware. Um, in fact, it's encouraged to be uh, distributed as long as it's distributed whole and with all the files attached. It's a virtual magnifying glass and you can see why uh, I'm doing a demonstration on it because it's so useful. Um, we'll create a desktop icon. There we go. Install it. It doesn't take very long. There's our icon just appeared and we can now launch the magnifying glass. There are two modes, dynamic mode and classic mode. We're going to click on the classic mode and that gives us this very useful magnifying glass. Um, I find the borders a little bit off-putting, it's a bit thick, but found through reading the uh, text file that accompanies this program by pressing B we can take it away. Um, nice thing about it, by using the arrow keys, arrow to the right will extend the glass, arrow down will deepen the glass and we can move around the whole screen with this magnifying glass. Um, this is just one of the, by rolling the uh, middle uh, button on the mouse, the mouse wheel, we can really zoom in to some fantastic um, levels there. Um, I have one lady who I teach um, computers to and she has got um, macular degeneration of the eyes um, where she can barely see but uh, using this glass she can actually make out some of the things she's supposed to do quite clearly. Um, nice thing about it to get rid of it you just left mouse click and to bring it back up again just click on the icon on the taskbar.